Hello there, I'm Miguel Blanca, E&M's SIG product specialist in Southern California. Although SIG is well known in the industry for its offering in safety products, which includes safety switches, safety controllers, safety laser scanners, and input devices like e-stops and reset buttons, today's topic will focus on SIG's newest safety light curtain, which is the DTEC 4 Prime. Let's get started. Oh my god! What did it just run over? I see scalp marks. I hope it works. Let's check it out. I have here a DTEC 4 Prime light curtain. This is a 300 mm protective height and a 30 mm resolution. The first thing you notice is that this has a very slim profile. And the second thing you notice is that there are no blind zones. What this means is that there are no spaces greater than 30 mm anywhere along the length of the light curtain. This includes the spaces between the top and bottom beam and the end caps. However, the DTEC 4 Prime has features that address three common issues found in the industry. These include cabling hassles, installation plus alignment, and commissioning time. Let's take a closer look. Many light curtains found in the market are equipped with non-standard or difficult to find connectors. With the DTEC 4 Prime, all you need is an M12, either 5-pin or 8-pin connector, depending on the model. This will reduce lead time as well as inventory cost. A built-in laser can be activated with a push button, reducing installation and alignment time. Its removable system plugs function like keys to unlock different built-in capabilities within the DTEC 4 Prime. This makes it very easy to configure and commission the light curtain. But wait, what if I order the wrong light curtain and I need additional features like cascading or built-in reset or additional diagnostics? How can the DTEC 4 help me? By removing two screws in the back of the light curtain, the user can change system plugs to unlock different functions built into the DTEC 4 Prime. For more information about the DTEC 4 Prime, please feel free to contact me. Thank you.